9th of August 1944. Alongside the bombardment of the city by heavy artillery, the Germans are able to use Stuka dive bombers to inflict widespread destruction across the city. With no air support of their own and using only light weaponry, the Poles are unable to fight back against this air menace and have to watch as the city is destroyed brick by brick and house by house. At the Polish security printing works, as in so much of the city, underground tunnels are dug so that fighters can get from one building to another. In the darkness, they go out to try and take out the artillery that's pounding the city, but are lit up by flares and beaten back by heavy machine guns. Across the city, resistance fighters push back attack after attack, with conditions getting worse and worse inside the city as supplies run out. Despite this, there is still a hope that the Allies, and in particular the Soviet forces just across the river who'd encouraged the Poles to rise up, will come to their rescue. Thanks for watching this episode of 63 Days of Extraordinary Courage. Please share your opinion using the hashtag 63days and look out for the next episode at 5pm Warsaw time, 11am Eastern Standard Time.